Welcome to Eric Blackman Music. Hi, and welcome to chord form tutorial number 240. The guitar is tuned standard, E-A-D-G-B-E, -E, and we're not using a capo. Our first chord is an A major chord. Just like that. We're holding down the D, the G, and the B string at fret 2, and everything else is open. Strumming that from the A, or A string, gives us a pure A sound. We can also strum that from the low E. Okay. Now we're going to do another A chord like this. We're going to use the same notes, but hold it a different way. We're going to be holding it with our first finger so that we can go to a D like this. Okay, here's our A. We're not after the high E string, but those strings in between there. We're going to go to a D chord by doing that. Okay, I'm holding down my A form there at the second fret, and I'm bringing in my middle finger to the B string, third fret, and my ring finger to the D string, fourth fret and we want this. That's what we're after. Right? Okay, so we get this. That kind of a sound. Next, we'll do a G chord. Just like that. Holding down the A string, second fret, the low E string, third fret, and the B and high E string third fret. That's G major. B minor 11, like this. For the B minor 11, we're going to hold down the A string second fret, the G string second fret, and the B string third fret, strumming from the A string. E minor 7 will be made this way. Once again, we're holding down the A string at the 2nd fret, and we're holding down the B and high E string at the 3rd fret, and strumming that from the low E string. We're going to make a G slash F sharp by simply taking the first finger and moving it up to the low E string, second fret. That's G slash F sharp. And that's it for chord tutorial number 240. Thanks for stopping by and have a great day.